trouble really is, Pete, is, well, it's just hit my confidence so much. I mean, if Edward, who, well, you know, claimed he was in love with me, well, I mean, if he suddenly overnight, as it were, ceased to be in love with me, then why should I be attractive to anyone else ever again? Mm. And I suppose the obvious question you're asking is, what do I feel about him now? I mean, do I still love him? I don't know. I feel hurt and raw that I don't really know what I think. I mean, is that love? Perhaps it is. I don't know. No. Well, do you think that's what being in love's like? Well, yeah, I mean, it... I don't know, really. <laughs> Could be. Yes, you're right. Yes, of course, you're right. Oh. Oh, I'm really very grateful to you for coming round, Pete. It's such a relief to hear somebody talking sense. <laughs> you know, I mean, not getting emotional, just being realistic, telling it to me like it is. Mm. And I suppose the other obvious question you're asking is, what would I do if Ed would suddenly phone me up out of the blue as if nothing had happened? Well... Yes, you're right, of course you're right. <laughs> well, there's only one thing I could do, slam the phone down on him. Mm. Oh, but the thing is, Pete, that... Hello? Oh, Edward, how wonderful to hear from you. <clears throat> <laughs>